The House Select Committee says former President Trump's pressure campaign on state officials led to public harassment and threatened their lives. The January 6th committee holding another public hearing on last year's Capitol riot. Everything we described today, the relentless destructive pressure campaign on state and local officials, was all based on a lie. Republican officials from Arizona and Georgia testified about former President Trump's efforts to overturn the 2020 presidential election results. They stood up to the president and turned him down. There was no, no evidence being presented of any strength. The committee played videos to lay out the case that the Trump team's pressure campaign led to state officials being harassed and threatened at their homes. Georgia Secretary of State Brad Raffensperger spoke about his phone call with President Trump days before the Capitol attack. The ballots are unsigned. The ballots are, are corrupt. Trump asked him to find nearly 12,000 votes, which would flip the state of Georgia in his favor. The numbers don't lie. We had many allegations and we investigated every single one of them. Before the hearing began, Trump blasted the committee. Legal analysts are now waiting to see if the Justice Department will bring any charges. The evidence pretty clearly shows his unfitness. It even suggests that he may be guilty of a crime. Maybe, maybe not. The committee will hold another public hearing on Thursday, this time focusing on Trump's pressure campaign on the Department of Justice. In Washington, Malda Rivera, Fox News.